Dr. Shangula says that with the reinfection rate on the increase, the public should not be discouraged from getting vaccinated against COVID. The anti-vaccination proponents, the campaign vaccination, they have no viable alternative to offer in relation to vaccinations. On analysis of the COVID-19 statistics from the 1st to the 11th of January 2022 shows that <clears throat> one, 81% of new infections is among the unvaccinated individuals. Two, 97% of admission to hospitals is of the unvaccinated individuals. Three, 94% of ICU admission is of the unvaccinated individuals. And finally, 91% of deaths is of the unvaccinated individuals. The Health Ministry, Dr. Shangula, is also disturbed by reports of some people obtaining COVID vaccination cards fraudulently without actually being vaccinated, saying this is tantamount to criminal offence. He also announced some amendment to the COVID-19 health regulations to come into effect next week. We vaccinated Namibians, permanent residents and truck drivers will no longer be required to present a negative PCR test results upon entry into Namibia. The above mentioned categories of people can enter the country at any time with a valid and authentic vaccination card. For all other categories of travelers, including truck drivers who are not fully vaccinated, the validity of a negative PCR COVID-19 test result remains 72 hours from the time of the collection of the specimen to the time the individual presents himself or herself at the point of entry into Namibia. Non-Namibians who arrive with PCR test result older than 72 hours and are not in a position of de-isolation certificate will be denied entry in the country. Lusangi Findaka, NBC News, Vanduk.